hi guys welcome back to my tube or should i call it at you because the moment you decide to hit that subscribe button you immediately become part of our family so welcome to our tube if you if you're a new subscriber i'm sure all of you are new subscribers at this point but welcome welcome to my tube let's make it our tube um into this video i'm cooking i'm cooking vegetables spinach and kale and ugali that's what we're having for dinner but um, I'm not going to show the process of ugali because the person making ugali said they are not very comfortable with that. So we're not going to share that. So you're just going to watch me making the spinach and the kale. And yeah, I hope you enjoy. Maybe try this recipe and tell me how you like it. Um, yeah. In the last video I posted, uh, I asked uh, you guys to help me pick a house that I'll be moving in with my siblings. So yeah, just bought house number one or house number two. And yeah, go with us. So yeah, enjoy today's video and um, show me, if, tell me if you'd like to watch more of that. In tomorrow's video, I'm going to show you the type of content or read to you the type of content that I'm going to be creating with you guys. So let's go together. Um, it's going to be fun. It's going to be, you know, uh, yeah, you'll see tomorrow. So as for now enjoy today's video please like like click share and subscribe let's grow our let's grow our tube let's grow our family but as for now please enjoy the video thank you And then I have the onions for the vegetables and um, the onions for the beef. So I'll see you guys when I start frying them. So now that I'm done with 
the vegetables i'm gonna start with them over here because um the meat is still defrosting so let's start on this so i'm going to put in just a little bit of oil um yeah and i personally like my onions well not 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 very well so it's and um guys i find it easier to put the salt while it's still like this because when i put it and the veggies are in it's usually harder for me to like mix it around so yeah let's let's start the gas on and cook so yeah we just wait till this turns brown well not brown till it softens up and um i just realized on the video i've posted that um i don't know what happened but it, I, I think i didn't turn on the comments and it's like a kid's video so we're gonna vote here in this video what house i pick and if you wanna show if you want me to show you the video so as we wait for this to brown i'm gonna go check on my meat and I'll be back with my meat, so let's wait for this, and then we put put in the vegetables, and then yeah. So when the onions are like this, is when I usually like to add my my vegetables. So I'll show you when I'm off camera. I went off, I went ahead and chopped coriander stems and added it here. It makes the taste better. So let me start on this. I'm gonna cut the tomatoes, the coriander, and the carrots off camera, and then I'll be back with you. So, I'll also show you when this is done. Um, now that this is almost ready, I'm gonna start preparing the meat. Probably gonna give it around um, five minutes on the stove and then finish with it. So, let's start on the meat. Okay, that is in the stove. It's about to start cooking. I have my tomatoes ready. These two don't really need to be chopped up till like the latter stages. Don't mind that mess. I'm gonna clear it up. So let's cook the meat. My meat is almost done. Meat. Guys, I'm not gonna cook the ugali simply because I do not know how to cook brown ugali. And where I am, that's what we eat. Let this get ready. I'll see you when I'm removing this from the fire and this is done. A bit of paprika, a bit of salt and a bit of oil plus the tomatoes and a little bit of water to make help the tomatoes get softer. Quickly, grate these carrots and put in the meat. So, as we wait for the tomatoes to soften, I'm going to grate the carrots, cut the coriander and then get back to it. So the meat is in, the carrots are in, the only thing remaining is the coriander and uh, as I was editing the first part of the video is when I noticed this so apologies I'm gonna get to cleaning to that. Once I switch this off I'll clean that so that when ugali starts being made it's clean. So yeah, so let's wait for this to boil for it to thicken up a bit because um, it's just soupy now as I up this a that's let's clean up so i'll be back when um this has started boiling and it's thickened and then work on this this is ready by the way i switched it off it's ready now for this and the ugali i'll see you when well when when this is done and then when i'm cleaning up this area this yeah, see you guys. So the meat has started boiling. Let's check on it. Not bad. Not, not bad. Um, let's see. Okay. I like how the water reduced and the sound of it. So probably gonna give it like five more minutes and then switch it off get to cleaning all right there. As I wait for it I'm gonna edit or put water for garlic so 
yeah five more minutes on the stove and you see yeah by the way i put in the coriander because why not so i put it in it's thicker now i'm gonna give it a few more minutes here and then i'll turn it off and then we'll clean this after that ugali and then i'm done i hope you all enjoyed today's video don't forget to like subscribe and share comment in the comment section which house i'd move into with my siblings and more ideas of what you want if this is your type of video let me know if it's not okay but um i'm focusing on everything so really yeah thank you for watching thank you for if you've enjoyed thank you don't forget to like hit that subscribe button and comment down below share share with your friends you never know i might be the smile of the day <laughs> Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. See you in the next video. Cooking beef and I'm cooking vegetables, Spanish and skuma, and kale, sorry, Spanish and kale, uh, and ugali.